Hi guys, today I will show how to transfer DNS, GoDaddy DNS uh, server to Google Cloud Platform server. So, for example, why do we need it? Let's imagine that you bought a great domain on GoDaddy. GoDaddy, its a domain domain name is provider. So we bought a great domain name and want to move it to Google Cloud Platform and run it on this platform. So, how to do it? First of all, let's go to our account and uh, take a look on domain we bought. So, for example, it's a keypro.io domain and uh, how to move it. So, first of all, we need to check DNS. We open DNS and uh, here we see name servers and the list of name servers domain names what we need to change. We need to configure it to use uh, Google Cloud uh, Engine's um, DNS names. Uh, then we will change it. So how to do it? First of all, we need to go to Google Cloud Platform and, uh, for example, create a virtual machine instance. Then we will connect this uh, instance with our domain. So let's imagine it's something like server. Uh, region zone doesn't matter. Uh, machine type we will take F1 micro. It's the smallest one and it's free. You can use one uh, such server in months and it will be free. So everything else is the same and don't forget to check low HTTP traffic. Uh, it will change firewall rules and then we can use, use it as a server. So create. So let's wait for a while. So uh, our server is, cre is created, so we need to connect to it. Uh, we will connect by SSH. Just click this button and uh, here. So we are here. First of all, we need to update our server. It's sort of to get update. And after that, we will install some server, something like Nginx. So to get install Nginx. Yes. So Nginx is installed and we can check it by opening our external IP and here we are. Welcome to Nginx. It works fine. So the next important step, we have this IP address and we need to do it static because right now it's a temporal ID, temporal uh, IP address. If we are going to use this IP address with our domain, domain name, so we need to be sure that uh, this IP address won't be changed after each server reload. How to do it? We go to our networks, external IP addresses. So we have our IP address and we just need to set it as a static uh, name. It will be our server IP and the resolve. And after that, this is a st static IP address and it won't be changed. So, the next step, how to move DNS to Google Cloud Platform. Let's go to Network Cloud DNS. And here we need to create a zone. Click Create Zone. Zone name, it's uh, some sample, for example, Server DNS name, for example, uh, it will be our site. It's keypro.io. This one is the same. Do not change it and then create. So already we have two records, two types, two records to, for two types is in S and uh, so on with uh, uh, domain names. Uh, DNS names, but we need to create two additional records. It's for uh, AP, APV4 address, it's uh, type A, and here we need to use our IP address what was provided by Google. We will add it here. Uh, 
record type is A. In case if we will have IPv6, then we can choose AAAA, and here will be address type of IPv6, but we need A, and click Create. After that, we need to add additional record for C name. In this case, we need to add www type C name, and here will be our address. For example, keypro.io. Click Create. So, this is now we created two records. And uh, the last step what we need, we need to copy this, um, this data, records, in S Cloud, and uh, update our name service on Google Cloud domain. So, for example, if we will update, uh, we can click Change. And uh, here I will use my own name service, and here I will move this NS Cloud domains to here. And uh, you can add all necessary domains, name servers, and then just save. And after a few minutes, uh, your Google Cloud server will be on. Uh, uh, on Google Cloud Platform. How to check it? So we can just open our website and uh, here it is, is already run on the server. I added some UI in just for to show how it works, but everything works fine. That's it.